Hello everyone, time to grind here, and today we're back with Dome Keeper. It's been a little bit. Last time we played, obviously they had reworked the assessor. It was real fun to check it out. But now they added Steam Workshop support for mods. Uh, so we're gonna be taking a deep dive into the world of modding. Uh, and starting, uh, we have installed two mods. There is uh, one or two other mods. The, the modding scene isn't huge right now, but there's a lot of fun stuff. And so I wanted to try out two mods. One very small one, Pet Magachi. It's just pretty much every time we go into the mines our pet technically goes into our HUD it's just a picture but something kind of cool the big mod that we're gonna be trying out right now is hydra launcher it adds a missile launcher gadget firing homing missiles at enemies so we're gonna see if we can find it in a game here uh, we're gonna just jump into a kind of normal classic game uh, we're going to go ahead and play assess or engineer um, we're going to uh, you know go to the laser dome um, our pet uh, you know what we're gonna pick a cat pet um, because uh, we got two cats Right, uh, since we played last, Kitten's literally lying on my lap right now. Um, and uh, we'll play uh, that suit. And we're gonna do the shield gadget. We'll keep it kind of simple here. We're gonna even stay on Relic Hunt here. Um, Cause I want to see if we can try to find it. We'll play on Brutal Mode, right? Dome's intended difficulty. Um, and I think we'll keep all these normal. Map size medium, right? Just kind of a run of the mill game, uh, just to hopefully find the Hydra gadget. Obviously, there's a small chance that we don't find it, uh, but I don't know. We're gonna find it. Don't even, don't even, don't worry about it here. So, if you guys have never seen this game, uh, we have a dome. We're on an alien planet. We have to protect ourselves. And look, so the the cat is in our HUD in the bottom right now. Isn't that sick? So that that's what the Tamagotchi mod does. Nothing like crazy, right? But uh, you know, pretty pretty cool here. Uh, especially since, uh, you know, collecting all these different pets are really cool in this game. Um, so we're going to start off. We're going to see when the next wave is. Uh, we're going to see what our health is. Um, and yeah. Which maybe I should have tried to upgrade my dude first. I don't. I haven't played Dome Keeper in a while, so, you know, don't, don't really remember. But, um, but yeah, they've also uh, been doing some blog posts. Um, about just kind of the future. Um, they're officially working on two new tower types or two new dome types. I think one's like um, I already forgot. I don't know. Two, two, two new cool dome types. Obviously, multiplayer they're working on as well, uh, which is uh, real exciting. Um, and uh, okay, yeah, we just need to save up enough to to get the first tier one upgrades for our character. I think that's going to be the priority. So hopefully we can find the Hydra missiles and stuff like that, uh, because that is uh. You know, going to be real nice. See, obviously, we're going to do drill strength there first. Kind of want all of them down the line. And uh, we're obviously going to be doing our, uh, you know, um, very convenient kind of mining, right? Our strip mining. Uh, last time we played, obviously, we played as the Assessor. And I do really still like the Assessor reworks. I think it makes it a lot more palatable and fun to play, um, for real. Uh, but I still am just always going to probably prefer the normal guy. Uh, one of the mods that I definitely want to try out in the future, if you guys do want to keep seeing more modded um, uh, content for Dome Keeper, there is an entire new uh, character called, like, the... the Oh, it's like some mole man or something like that. So I wanted to start off simple, right? Just see if we could find these kind of like cool homing rockets because that sounded really, really cool. Um, and if you guys want to see more, you know, there's, uh, you know, a whole new kind of character, modded character that we could try out. So let me know. But um, either way, we're going to level up our jetpack speed. We're just going in a little bit faster. And then obviously we want to get the carry speed um, because... Uh, carrying four is not terrible, but I just love look at that cat in the bottom left. I don't know why I just think that's like the best mod ever um, I'm assuming it's just literally copying whatever our cat is doing in the dome and just like, you know Putting that picture there, but I don't care. It's amazing um, Okay, so we've got tier one upgrades for everything here We're gonna continue our strip mine, but I, I just like the main guy because like I don't know I can just strip mine and kind of turn my brain off a little bit in terms of the, uh, the mining phase, and I don't know, like, I just, like, that's what I really like about that game. Same thing in, like, Minecraft, right? The mining is just kind of an appealing part of it, and the assessor just makes the mining a little bit difficult, even with the rework, right? It's still a little bit iffy, you know? Um, and so it's kind of nice to just have a game plan, be mining, you know, looking for the gadgets and stuff. Simplicity makes it work. Yeah, exactly. I could just kind of do my own thing down here, even if I wasn't doing a specific strategy of mining, you know, strip mining, um, still would be a little bit easier 
And I, I think the reworks helped a lot, like we talked about last video, but... Um... I'm gonna level up the, uh, oh, did I, oh, I didn't have water. Yeah, I need water for that. Um, uh, yeah, we've only found, uh, the iron. Normally we would have found some, which is decent, because you need iron very badly right early on. So I'm not gonna complain about that, but, um, would be nice to find some water, um, or some cobalt, stuff like that. Could be pretty helpful. But it is nice to be playing Dome Keeper again. Hey, there's some water. Okay, we haven't played Dome Keeper in a little bit. Hey! We said what we needed and we got both of them. Very, very nice. Isn't it faster to keep drilling and take the loot at the end instead of going back and forth? Same one. To keep drilling, take the loot at the end? I don't know. Um, the problem is, is like... You can only carry a certain amount, you know, so. Um, okay, so we're going to do strength. I like doing the uh, shield of the, the the dome shield or whatever. A little bit uh, upgrading it first. We're also going to yeah, try to save that up for hardening. Probably just get ready here for combat. Okay, go to the right here. All the enemies on the right. Sides. Projectile man Following you Yeah, it's kind of nice. We definitely want to upgrade our laser at least once next um, Because that will be very useful um, And we're going to very much need that we got some water here Which I don't know what we'll use it on Obviously we're gonna need okay a lot of water here a lot a lot of a lot of stuff here See like if I were to try to pick everything up like I can technically carry it. I just so slow. So it's like I kind of just want to make sure I bring in everything that we need to be bringing in, you know. Um, let's do this. And now we can upgrade the hardening to help our melee damage reduction a little bit. Um, and let's see. I'll look like yeah, I can literally see what the cat's doing there. It's like scratching some sort of wall or something like that. We got some iron here. Just trying to do uh, dig a little bit more. Since we have a little bit of time before I need to go back up. You only care where you can, but then you expose more of the mine for the next round. Multiple trips in the same run this time. I don't know. I don't know. I've always done it this way and we've been okay, but maybe there's a more optimal way, but I'm not like struggling enough to need to try to pivot, you know? Um, so we need one more. Uh, Cause yeah, these inventory and cycle counter are kind of worthless. Like to me, it, like they're, they're convenient, but like, I don't feel like I need them and stuff like that. You know, um, we'll just fight. We just need more iron. We could have got one of the cheaper laser upgrades, but it's more concerned with, uh, I want the damage up one first. I'm going to prioritize the range, guys. One, because I'll be fine to get these, but also because uh, we have the damage uh, reduction on the, uh, the melee stuff, which is really nice. And there was, I, there was a little bit more to the right I could dig, but I'm not going to waste my time going all the way back there. Just being a good, a good strip miner here. Doing our, doing our job. Hey, there's the iron we need. So yeah, like normally, like like here, I'll probably like grab it all, and then just continue mining until I wait. Like that is something I kind of do, right? Like I'm not gonna like go all the way back right now. But if I like found enough where I I wouldn't be able to mine it fast enough or, or bring it fast enough, that's when I probably like you know. A lot of times, like, want to head back. But here it's fine because we got time. Right? It, it makes sense to just use this time. My cat in the dome looks like a mouse. I think there is a mouse pet. I'm pretty sure one of the pets is a mouse pet. Probably try to, like, clean this up as well. The more I clean this up, the less I'll get, like, kind of stuck and stuff. Okay. So we cleaned up a little bit. And we can go ahead and upgrade... 
the the laser uh, just power. Um, that is a big one here. So just a lot more damage. We definitely probably want to get one more upgrade on it, and then probably start focusing on the tier two uh, upgrades for the miner. Um, this they were all they all just lined up for me here. That was not hard at all. That was not hard at all. So I really hope that we get to find the new modded gadget. Oh, oh, here's a gadget. Please, please let it me be the rockets. Please let me be the rocket. I think it's like I get a choice. So we have to get lucky and hope that we find the choice of it. Come on, please, please, please modded rockets. Modded homing rockets. <gasps> we got it. We got it. We got it. So we could just super focus on this. I'm so happy. Hydra launcher. We found the modded gadget. Um, launches multiple enemy seeking missiles. Let's go. So now we have a use for this water here, right? Oh, dude, all that artwork too. It's got its own. Like, this is a mod. This is a mod. Um, okay, so I can't afford any of this. Lowers the time needed for each missile salvo to, bat uh, to do battery. You've got the damage of each missile. Um, you've got the capacity, so how many missiles you have. Um, and then these are two special ones. Fires additional missiles automatically at enemies while the Hydra Launcher is active. Um, or missiles stun enemies but deal much less damage. So the auto tracker sounds uh, kind of cool there, uh, to be completely honest. That's probably what we're going to try to do here. But So now I'm going to way less focus on, um, on my laser. Um, and we are definitely going to focus on the Hydra Launcher because that is what we were trying to highlight here. Um, and, uh, oh, a lot of iron here. Okay, like, see, this is just going to take me so much time. I'm going to just, like, bring this up here. Could do this in multiple trips. That's maybe what would be worth it. So I'm going to do one upgrade of the laser. Um, I think it definitely would be faster to lower some of these. I don't know. But we're going to upgrade the, uh, the, the trackings. Uh, the, the tracking missiles once and then we're gonna try to start getting the tier two of our miner here I think that's pretty important. Ooh, that was spooky lightning. I don't know what that was um, Okay, so we're going to upgrade. Let's go ahead and get ah, Actually, let's just do both here We're going to do the damage of the missiles and we're going to extend the capacity of the missiles here um, And then that's how fast they reload so let's see let's see how the missiles work here First time seeing them here. Okay, I need, I need help. Shoot at them. Oh, I have to press Y? Oh, I have to press Y. I have to actually summon them. That is interesting. I have to summon them. So they kind of charge. That is interesting. Okay, so I get to summon them. They don't automatically happen. They look cool, though. That is so high quality. That is such a high quality mod. Like, those animations and the art look sick. The only thing that looks not technically 100% official is the thing actually on the dome. But that's fine, though. Yo, yo, Manny. How you doing, my man? Haha, <laughs> I get it. Yeah, we are, we are, we are checking out Mata Dome Keeper for the first time ever. More like down this. I don't get it. I don't get that one. That one over my head. Um, okay, so let's, uh, you want this blanket? No. No. Um, okay, so a lot of iron here. This, oh, nice. Okay, so this is going to allow us to get, I'm going to just, uh, we could try to do this here. Oh, it was a typo. So this is, yeah, we definitely need to start getting the tier two. We're not able to carry much. We're kind of slow. So we'll probably try to get tier two of all of the drill, uh, all of the minor upgrades and then keep upgrading the hydro launcher thing. Um, okay, let's see here. Um, okay, yeah, so just do more drill speed. Not super excited to take that because I don't think we need it right now, but that's okay. Okay, so immediately Hydro Launcher. Hydro Launcher again. Hydro Launcher. Dude, I love it! I love, dude, this Hydro Launcher thing is insane! <laughs> I love it. Should I get canes? You should. 
That you have probably convinced me. I think I'm going to get Canes after my stream. I know. I was gonna say I want Canes. Yeah, you you have made me and Caitlin want Canes. So me and Caitlin will be eating Canes uh, later today. Um, you should get Canes. Canes sounds amazing. I'm gonna bring this because this has to get planted somewhere. I think. Um, let's start growing stuff right here. Should just plant itself. It's not doing anything. What are you doing? Dude, what the fuck? Where, where? It fell all the way down. I'm wasting so much time here. No, please don't plant it. Do I need to put this? I thought I had to plant it somewhere. Oh, I have to plant it on a... Oh, I have to plant it on an ore. I do have to do that. I do have to do that. The problem is... Okay, we're going to drop it right here. Oh, we wasted so much time. I want to put it on uh, something accessible and close by, but... Oh, my dude. I, oh, okay. Ah, shit. Okay, whatever. I could have put it there. There is water down there. I could plant it on the water. I Ah, I wasted a lot of time here. Oh, it's still planted? Wait, it's still planted. Shit, shit, shit. Get in here. Auto rockets. Auto rockets. All of the auto rockets, save me, please! Hydro launcher. Kill the kill the projectile guy, please. Ah shit, I couldn't hit that out of the build out of the thing. Okay. Hydro launcher, kill the guy in the this flying. No, oh, okay, 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 there we go. Dude, the oh my god, that's amazing! Okay. Oh, I fucked it up. I don't even know. I, I think it it does iron if you plant. Okay, so I was I should have planted it up there. I think if you don't choose, it'll auto do iron. I'm not 100% sure though. Not 100% sure. Also, am I fucking this up? I am. I should be strip mining right here. Lot of goodies here for us. So we need to go get the uh, tier twos. So this will probably be for. Okay, yeah, I can't carry all this here. So we're gonna just mine a little bit more. More water. So after we get tier two, we definitely are gonna have enough water to keep up. I want to, my goal is to max upgrade the modded Hydra missiles, right? Pretty sure that is how it works, okay. So at least we'll get a little bit. I wanted to plant it up here. I, sh I That's what I was attempting to do, but whatever. Um, so we're gonna now get the tier two of the speed. So maybe I can now vroom. And grab what I was missing. Just gotta make sure not to destroy that uh, one thing, right? Okay, so we should be able to bring all this up in time. And then we're gonna just uh, try to grind a little bit more for the carry strength. And then that'll uh, give us a little bit more room. Maybe we upgrade the shield one more time than all the Hydra missile stuff. Right? I am in love with these Hydra missiles, though. Okay, we're gonna spawn one of them. Hydro missiles again. Hydro missiles again. Hydro missiles again. So we've already done a lot of damage. To that. Hydro missiles. Just do a lot of damage to the shields. Hydro missiles. Dude, those hydro missiles are so satisfying. Um, so, okay, one more of uh, whatever the red thing is, cobalt, and we can get more of the melee damage reduction. So obviously we're gonna wanna prioritize you know, hitting the uh, projectile guys. You need some space above the place. Oh, if you plant it. Yeah, that is true. That is true. Hey, more. We got plenty of water. That's for sure. Hey. Okay. Yeah, this is a lot. I'm going to carry some of this here. See, it's like this is when I just start going, right? Like, because I can't carry all of this. I'm going to be unbelievably slow. So that's why, like, if I know I have enough, I just, I bring what I can, right? Um, This might be able to get us the strength. I'm not sure. Um, ah, we were one away. Okay, we should have time to grab the rest here. For the new wave spawns. Yeah, we got the modded Hydra Launcher. It was our first gadget. We got really lucky finding it, so we we're going to try to max it. 
But I'm very excited for modding, because, like, I don't know, we could just start making a lot of modded Dome Keeper videos in between updates, you know? Okay, so here we go. Finally got the uh, carry strength. And I will go ahead and upgrade Electro Blast. Let's get a Reflection Shield, because we do want to just really prioritize. Um, actually, yeah, let's do that. We don't normally do that one. We'll do that. And then I don't think I can afford... Dude, that wind, hearing it in Dome Keeper is so cool. Probably want to upgrade the our laser a little bit more, but I really just want to prioritize the Hydra Launcher, you know? Hydra Launcher. Hydra Launcher. Probably just spamming of these here, because we got a bunch of big guys we need to kill, right? Okay. As soon as the guy spawns, we're going to... Hydra Launcher! Nice. Dude, I love the Hydra Launcher. <laughs> That's so insane, dude. Still got more iron down here. And we are playing Relic Hunt. So, like, here, I'm not going to go back, right? That'd be a waste of time. Um, so, we're obviously playing Relic Hunt, my favorite mode. Prestige is cool. Uh, probably especially for people that play the crap out of this game. I love the main game mode here, Relic Hunt. That's what we're doing for those of you guys, new peeps. I might be able to carry. Let's see. How much? Oh, dude. Oh, dude. This is a lot. Um, okay, we can actually carry this decently here. So, still got a little bit of time, so I'm going to just go continue doing this here. I'm going to spank by Nightbot. Sorry. Okay, see, I can't carry all this, so this is where I'm going to drop some and just now try to go. It was an ad quote. I know, I honestly might just get rid of... I don't think Hatchet Daddy's here. Um, next time I see Hatchet Daddy, I may just have him get rid of that entirely, honestly. Because we could just have... Mo like, if someone's just spamming caps, then we could just address it at that point, right? Um, okay, so I want to upgrade... Yeah, definitely the Hydra Missiles. Okay, let's... Uh, lowers the time needed for each missile. Salvo. I think you can upgrade that three times. Pretty sick. <laughs> Appreciate it, SLX. Okay, let's grab all of this. Might be able to just upgrade the uh, the reload time twice. Just really early on. Actually, no. This If we can upgrade one of the major things for it, that's probably the better play. Let's see. Um, yeah, 8 and 3. So we're just going to increase the damage here. Because that opens up some of this. Like the auto tracker fires additional missiles automatically at enemies while the hydro launcher is active. That is so cool. Um, okay, let's go for it. Hydro launcher. Hydro launcher. Hydro launcher. <laughs> I love this. I love this mod so much. I love it so much. Oh, dude. Modded Dome Keeper is going to be a game changer. Um, okay, so, I don't even know, okay, here, we had to dig so straight down, it was like, I was like trying to figure out where our strip mining actually was, yeah, this mod's pretty cool, right, just in anything to increase the variety, right, like, just new fun toys, we always talk about, you know, with roguelikes, you want new fun toys to play around with always, and that is exactly what these mods are gonna do. And like I said, if you guys want to keep seeing more modded content, there's at least one more good mod. A whole new driller. You know, the Mole Man or something. We could try. Um, I'm tempted. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and... Because I think the Hydra Launchers are doing good for us here. I'm going to go ahead and try to get Tier 3 of driller upgrades here. I think if we can get that and be okay, that is going to be huge. Because we are starting to run into things that are taking forever to mine and stuff like that. So... There's a little thing waving at us there, too. So I think that's what we're going to go for. Just an early uh, Tier 3 upgrade for uh, all of the, uh, the the miners and stuff like that. Or the, my driller or whatever. I don't think I can get it yet. I don't know. I should actually... Mm, yeah. 
think it's worth trying. I could just actually, you know what? I'm going to get the move speed and the laser sight. Just the tier one upgrades for the laser because laser is important, right? I know we're focusing on our hydro launcher, but I don't know. Those are very important ones, I think, right? Okay, reflection. Oh, dude, reflection actually helped me against the, uh, the one flying guy. Dude, oh my gosh, that's amazing. Okay, so now we definitely want to... Oh, okay. Well, I should have waited, but whatever. Um, now I definitely want to uh, prioritize um, the, the tier 3 upgrades for the, the driller. While we look for a the relic. The relic that will allow us to win the game. Because, yeah, obviously, like, this drilling is taking a long time. I probably should have done that. I just... I don't know. I had 10 exact iron... And I could just spend it on the things I thought I needed. This is a lot of iron, though. Um, I am directly below, so because I'm directly below, I'm going to just go ahead and deposit this. Because if we find a big thing to the left, then... So this is 2, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we're still going to be 2 away from an upgrade, so can't upgrade that. Let's do that. Don't have a ton of time, but we got a little bit of time. Um, we have to do this a little bit in a bootleg way, but I think I can at least mine this here. Okay, I'll just clean up. Wasted a little bit of time. It's okay, though. I'm gonna widen this area out here. Okay. A lot of guys to the left. Hydro launcher, hydro launcher, hydro. Oh, that is so many guys to the left. And then I have the reflection, right? To help protect me against, uh, oh, dude. <laughs> dude, the hydro launcher is insane. Oh, we already got another one? What? Okay. Now we're at 11. So, yeah, definitely tier three upgrades for the, uh, the miner here. Because we are on brutal difficulty, so, you know, we want to... We're doing okay. I know, dude. The, the hydro launcher is insane. The, the combat phases are getting, going by so fast. We got some water. A got some iron. So we're going to be able to get our drilling speed here. I'm going to see if I can carry all of this. I could not at all. <laughs> so let's try to take half of it here. And um, I guess, yeah, we're not going to have time to come back. So I'll just start using this time to mine a little bit. This is definitely going to take a long time. Mod might not be perfectly balanced, but we like that anyway. <laughs> Balance is boring. Yeah. It's very fun. Very, very fun. Right, like, if you had never played Dome Keeper, I would obviously, like, recommend you to get the vanilla experience. But we have, like, 20 hours in the game, right? We've recorded 20 episodes. Every time there's a new update, we play it. Um, you know, if we ever are playing more official content, we'll probably disable all the mods, you know, to see what the intended experience is. But So, a lot of this here. So, we can go ahead and get drill speed. And, oh, we can go ahead and get melee damage reduction on that. So, now the rest of our cobalt can be spent on that. Um... Automatic repair is pretty cool, so I think I will spend two of this for the adaptive wave warmer and the exit route. Oh, I didn't even need that. I'm so dumb. It was the health that led to automatic repair, because automatic repair is pretty good. So I guess we have those. Didn't really need them, but whatever. Reflection. <laughs> Dude, we are killing so fast. I don't know if this is worth it, just constantly getting the one right up, but I'm going to keep doing it. Um, yeah, this is this is a little bit strong. <laughs> Definitely a little bit strong. Uh, there was more we could pick up over here. And prime mine a little bit. So it is going to tell us when we need to leave, and it's going to tell us the exact optimal exit route. I 
I thought that was what led to automatic repair. Um, I don't have 12 with this, do I? No, I definitely don't. Let's just try to mine a little bit more. Because it will tell us now, like, when we need to get the hell out of here. Hey! Getting a new relic. So I'm going to keep mining, because it should tell us when we need to go. And it should tell me the fastest way to get out of here, too, now. See? Okay, there we go. It's saying we got to go, go this way. And I think it takes into an account everything you're holding as well. Though I don't know. I don't know. Still felt a little bit slow there. So we could have a tell. Okay, we'll do the probe. So we have that probe that we can use now. And Hydro Launcher, Hydro Launcher. Pull up the reflecting thing. I'm going to take a decent amount of damage there. Dang, we did take a decent amount of damage there. Hydro Launcher, go! Okay. So we have a probe now. Could upgrade HP. I'm trying to bum rush these uh, upgrades here. The tier threes, I think, is what I really want to do. Sensor is adaptable, meaning it's not at its best when you get it. Yeah, so we'll probably try to invest a little bit in that too, obviously. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's just try to carry this all. I will use this opportunity to mine though. Oh. Okay. Hold us about a little bit of water. Though I can't carry all this at all, so. See if I can mine a decent bit. Get to that kind of center area that we had. You don't invest in it, it automatically adjusts. Wait, what? What? Isn't there the whole perk tree? For it? Look in that menu. Yeah, we have to upgrade it, right? Oh, oh, you're talking about this thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, the uh, adaptive, yeah. When it's time to head back to the dome because of a wave is about to arrive, it is adaptable and improve its accuracy. Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. So we'll get uh, more speed. Like I said, I want to try to bum rush the, um, you know, tier three upgrades here. Because we're strip mining, I'm less uh, worried about the probe. Hi, drill launcher. Hi, drill launcher. I don't know why. Whatever. Hi, drill launcher. Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm starting to maybe struggle a little bit. Not really. The hydro launchers are pretty bad against single targets. Or like the not sorry, the 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 ones where it's like multiple people. You know. You're definitely a lot faster now. You have room in here. But I, I can't remember if the probe helps you with the relic or not. I don't think it does. Grab these. It doesn't, yeah. But I honestly may not use it. Probably should have just shredded it. Make it be decent. Oh, that's right. That is It is an upgrade, yeah. Oh boy! All right, we're just we're gonna multiple trips here. I think we have time for both trips because I can't. If I had it all, I wouldn't care. I wouldn't be able to carry it. Um. Yep. And we have tier three of uh, our guy. 
What if we rush tier four of our guy? Nah. I think we should get our, um, I think we need to get our missiles up. Either that or maybe more of the shield. I'm not quite sure. I'll just bring this up. Do that. Time to use the radar refill. Okay. Um, actually let's do, let's do a single max HP. That way we could do automatic repair. I think that's going to be uh, pretty nice. Um, and we will still upgrade this by doing the recharge speed. So it just recharges a lot faster now. We did still upgrade that. Wasting a little bit of time here. Okay. Hi, you're a launcher. Okay, automatically gonna get that uh, reflection thing. Okay, yeah, the the reflector helped a lot there. Helped quite a lot. We can, re dude, the reload on it is so much better now too. Probably should save this for when I'm on the way back up, but whatever. Okay. Um, yeah, because I definitely want to try to get the Hydra uh, missiles uh, max before we. Um, before we end the game, right? So I don't know. We still haven't found even close to where the relic is, so. Oh. We're being funneled down, funneled in here. A little bit more water. Hey. Hey. Oh. Kinda. Work a little cave down here. Ooh, ooh! I can carry all this too. Let's go, dude. Our our carry our carry upgrade. Getting those tier threes. Uh, we're very nice. So we're gonna we're gonna uh, mine a little bit here. Probably start heading up pretty soon here though. Okay. With the water, I'm not gonna be able to carry this all. We're gonna attempt though. <laughs> we're gonna attempt it. No, I gotta I gotta drop a couple. I gotta drop like three. It's like if there's a certain point where you are like over encumbered and you are not gonna go anywhere. This is a big haul though. Yeah, if we were carrying on to those other things, I don't I don't think we would have made it. Um, okay. So let's go ahead and let's let's get this really cool uh, if we can the auto tracker fires additional missiles automatically at enemies while the hydro launcher is active. I don't really know what that means, but we got it. We dang got it. Um, and yeah, there's nothing I can really do with just the excess of water here. Um, it says use water. I think I have to buy to yeah. Use that multiple times. I guess we'll just go ahead and get the inventory, the wave counter. Not that it matters, but I just I have such an influx of influx of water right now. Oh yeah, it's just yeah. Look at that. It's just firing automatically now. Let's go. Just keep firing missiles, dude. Yeah, the hydro launcher just keeps firing them. It's just constantly firing some. That's so <laughs> sick. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love this so much, dude. This Hydra launcher missile thing is ridiculously cool. Um, and we were somewhere. I don't know where we were. We were here. There we go. Is there more down here? I don't think so. No. Okay. So we'll just continue our strip mine operation here. Unless our prone tells us our probe tells us where anything is. Hey, 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 hey! Okay, we're gonna just try to carry this all. Oh my god, that's so much iron. That's so much iron. It'll take us a little bit to get up, but. I think it's worth it. I don't know, probably isn't. Like, you go so slow. 
Uh, so next time I see that thing, it's ready for me. I'm going to wait so I can start taking them when I'm on my way up. And we'll have time to uh, fix our prone. A probe. I don't know why I keep saying prone. Oh my gosh, that is so much. Okay, let's... Might be getting close to maxing the, uh, the missiles here. Um, we are now going to do... Extend the capacity of the uh, missiles. This is an 18-2. Oh my gosh, you go from 4 to 8. So we definitely need to save up for that. Actually, you know what? We'll go ahead and get recharge speed. So we've maxed out the recharge speed. So now, once we get... What is that? Freaking 15 more uh, iron... <laughs> We're going to go from four to eight missiles. That is insane. Um, I was going to see if that one was ready for me here. I might do the probe. I'm going to try to save maxing this out. Okay. Hydro launcher, go! Nice. Go, hydro launcher, go! <laughs> That's so satisfying. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off on that. No, it's unoptimal. Maybe I should have just taken it. I should have just picked it up. It didn't mean I had to bring it up. We are too late now. We must find the relic. We gotta be getting cl oh 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 we're in the end game here we're in the end game we're in the end game we found one of the first relic things we found one of the first relic things so I will before we beat the game though I will make an effort to make sure we max out the uh, the things here yeah we uh, we run that won that run appreciate it now we can grab this. I don't think this is 18. Famous last words. Nah, no way we lose this. No way. I don't know why I'm going down here. I don't think I really have any time. It'll tell me when I gotta go back, though. There we go. Yeah, because we... Oh, we could do it already! Okay, four to eight missiles. We have maxed out the Hydra Launcher. Oh, my gosh. Ah, that's so many! That's so many! <laughs> go! Go, Hydra Launcher, go! Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, now we can take the W. Now we can take the W. Oh my gosh. Four to eight is insane. Oh, this is something where if we bring two iron here, it'll zoom the screen out, which is really good. If we find any iron, we'll do it. Though I don't, I guess it's not really useful anymore, but we're just looking for the relic. There's obviously something down here. Oh no, it's not. It doesn't zoom it out. It gives you, yeah, one more layer of visibility. That's right. Been a little bit since we played. Hey, okay, we see we see a line somewhere. So there's still a. Here we go. Here we go. A. Okay. So this is where the main relic thing is. We found that. We just have to find the couple batteries that uh, power it, and then we can win the game. There's some other battery going up here. Yep, so there's going to be another battery somewhere up here. I 
I mean, we could get even stronger, but I don't feel like it's that necessary. I feel like I'm, I feel like we've, we've, we, we got to the max, which is what I was mainly looking for. I would have continued strip mining if we hadn't maxed. Okay, let's go. But normally, I'm gonna take the W when we, when we can. If this was in prestige, we might want to like continue going, but. I got the one there though. Okay, Hydro Launcher. Oh, see, so yeah, it's not great against those single targets. I mean, that's just insane. That is such an insane amount of Hydra missiles. That is so ridiculous. Yeah, definitely not one of the most balanced mods ever. But uh, definitely fun. Definitely freaking fun. Okay, so there's got to be another battery somewhere in here. We've already powered those up? So there's like, okay. Looks like there's still one more up though. That's so interesting. I don't know. Um... We know that there's one to the top left somewhere here. Is this gonna take us some time to find this anyways? Where you at? I haven't found it yet. I have to go up here in a second. Hey, is that it? Hey, we did it. We did it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, we're gonna have to wait one more wave. I wonder if we're, we can win a wave without having to let it save us. Can you predict the next upgun update will be? Uh, I have zero clue. Uh, I do not really know on that one. Yeah, I haven't heard too much. I mean, the dev told me he would let me know like ahead of time, you know, a little bit before it comes out, but. Dude, these Hydra launchers are absurd. Okay, let's go beat the game here. Let's go beat the game! We found the relic! We found a relic! I doubt there's gonna be anything that we could really upgrade here. We do have a bunch of the auto healing, so that may help us. So otherwise, don't really know what we could actually upgrade. Yeah, not really anything. Okay, let's see if we can win without the relic. OP Hydra Launcher. Reflection! Come on! Come on, Hydra Launcher! Save me! Reflection, save me! Oh, we're taking damage! Hydra Launcher! And we have the auto heal. I think we could do it. I think we really could. Come on, Hydra Launcher. Come on, Hydra Launcher. Keep going, keep going, Hydra Launcher. Maybe I should have been focusing on the guy on the top. No, he's dead. Oh, dude, we're gonna be able to do it. <laughs> we beat it without the relic. Dude, the <laughs> modded Hydra Launchers are absolutely insane. 
absolutely insane. I am so glad that we were lucky enough to be able to, uh, you know, find it first try and stuff like that. But there you go. The modded, uh, you know, homing hydro launcher. Absolutely insane. I'm very excited for the future of what modded dome keeper may look like. Um, so, you know, if you guys are watching after the fact on YouTube and you want to see some more dome keeper mods, let me know. Uh, there's a uh, cool, uh, you know, like I said, the mole miner or whatever uh, mod that could be really fun to check out. So let me know if you want to see more. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe. Ring that bell. Go to the big boy YouTuber. Say to be notified when more dome keeper videos come out. If there are some, they'll be on the screen right next to me. And if you guys are going to be grinding out some dome keeper on your own, then I wish you guys luck and see you all next time.